All right, we are starting a new game called James Cameron's Avatar. Enjoy. All right, welcome to another fantastic new game. Gameplay walkthrough thingamajig by projects by me, Perseus, the best of the best. So, today we are going to play James Cameron's avatar. So, we're just gonna pick our avatar, our human and our avatar. And why do they all look like Chinese? This, this guy's Chinese, obviously. And a Chinese chick. Okay, a black guy. Oh, this one looks good. Another Chinese chick. Okay. Definitely Chinese. Come on, people. Oh, this one looks great. Okay. This one was seven. Okay. Okay. Nigga, 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 nigga. You did not just say that. Okay. I'm just gonna go with number seven. Um, I'm gonna go with projects. Hell's Gate. Fill your XP gauge with green quest. This one has no rewards for you. The experience menu displays all available rewards. Awesome. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Same thing as far as I'm concerned, but I won't be dealing with you on Pandora, okay? You're Dr. Harper's problem. You disappoint him, and that becomes my problem. So I got three words for you. Don't screw up. I got it. Shit. So file away fantasies of a tropical vacation. If you go cowboy like the rest of these jarheads, you'll be dead inside two weeks. I guarantee this planet is the most hostile world you've ever seen. But you keep an open mind. And she'll reward you in ways you can't imagine. Really? Give me a million bucks for starters. So, who's a watcher? What are you? Commander Falco's been damn near frantic for your arrival. Really? He's the reason you're here, but I'll let him explain it all. First things first, let's get you up to speed. Wow, five years of sleep in space and now it's go, go, go. A lot's happened while you were in stasis, and not all for the better. Now that the noisy stuff is out of the way, let's check your avatar. Dr. Monroe should have it ready to go. You set? Are you kidding? It's all I've dreamed about for five years. Yeah. <laughs> Just watch yourself around Dr. Monroe. He treats the avatars like his own personal guinea pigs. Great. Kanjar wants you to meet Senior Scent Officer... No, no, no. 
in the Avatar Link Center. Okay, can I go anywhere else? Let's have a little look around, look around shall we? No, man, so many missiles. Cars! I want one! It, Fuck you. I mean, be you. Yeah. <laughs> Shut up! I'm a Kick your ass! There, well, I'm gonna choose spoiler alert the avatars. No, I'm just kidding. Alright, nothing here. Let's go on. Will you move it? I got a tattoo on my head. Awesome. So how do I walk like the rest of these guys? Wow, I got a map? Transport, awesome. Alright, I like this. Wait, let me just... Wow, awesome. Experience, what's this? Oh, cool. Pandora, Flora. Okay. And I've got like... 14% already done. How is that even possible? Ooh. Wow. Avatars. Awesome. What the? Stay Ooh. sharp if you want to survive out here. I gotta collect stuff like this? Are you kidding me? Yeah. Oh, thank you for noticing, idiot. Okay, I'm kind of at a loss for words here, so yeah, just go with me. The signal specialist. About time you showed up. Day one, and you're already behind schedule. Head over to the link there. Let's put you into your avatar and see if you're worth the small fortune it costs to send you. Chop chop. We're not paying you by the hour. Nice to meet you too. Senior science officer Victor Monroe at your service. And just because your DNA is a one in a billion match doesn't mean you can be a princess. Get moving, Tiara. What a bitch! Into the link there. Dorothy? Hmm. This will seem a little straight. Okay. Take it slow. You might feel a bit disoriented. Looking good, Ryder. You're doing well. This is trippy. 
All's normal. Your readings are solid. Baby steps right. You look good. You're actually quite good at this. With my fine tuning, you'll be zipping about with the best of them. You're a fine specimen, Ryder. Now run along. Officer Midori is waiting for you. That's it? Are you kidding me? Red along that line. I don't know what's going on today. Commander Falco's ready for you. He's eager to meet you. He usually doesn't interact with the avatars. Hates them. Folks got a thing against avatars? Like I said, there's more going on here than you know. You don't want to be in his bad books. Elevator will take you to Falco. Good luck, Ryder. Yeah, thanks. Yeah. I'm gonna need it. Where is the elevator? What is or the other way. Um. Okay. Come on. Okay. This guy has his own personal elevator. Are you kidding me? I want a personal elevator. Whoa. What the hell? I believe you're finally here. Seems like a lifetime ago I approved your commission papers. Reporting for duty, sir. Drop the formalities, kid. I've got a priority one situation. Someone in the Avatar program is feeding classified RDA info to the local Navi tribe. If word gets out what we're planning, we gotta have a full-scale native uprising on our hands. What exactly are we planning? You'll see soon enough. It was me who fought to get you here. Your skills as a codebreaker are highly underrated on this planet. Play your cards right and you'll go far. Screw up, and this planet will spit you out like hoagie bait. What? I'll do my best. Right now, your job is to find that mole. Gather your gear and thumb a lift to the lagoon base. Time to hit the ground running. Yeah, great. So, who's my pilot? Is anybody going with me? Or am I going alone? Travel agent, okay. Okay. Okay, I see. Basically, I don't, but it doesn't matter. Equipment. Anything else? No, that is it. Maintenance, please report to the motor pool. Maintenance to the motor pool. It's maintenance, not maintenance. Where do you want to go? Blue Lagoon, I guess.
Right? I ain't I just a code breaker or I mean a signal specialist? What the hell? Why am I fighting then? Welcome to the park, sir. The park? Yeah, Blue Lagoon. We fenced in the whole area. Big check of Pandora Wilderness. You want to see the planet? This is the safest place to do it. How are we supposed to see the planet from inside a fence? Seriously, man, you do not want to go beyond the fences, okay? I heard about a dude lost his arm to a plant. A freaking plant! Are you serious? Like the clap. Officer Midori's waiting for you near the main gate. Oh, here, here, yeah, okay, I get it. I get it, I get it, okay. Damn, I'm packing! Ryder, you're just in time. We've got troops caught in the wire. They're reporting viper wolves moving on them. Viper wolves? You'll love them. You've worked a turret, right? Uh... Good. Climb the main gate and lay down some covering fire. Move it! Are you serious? Um... Oh, that's my life. Okay. Not bad for a signal specialist. Fuck you. Thanks. This isn't over yet. We still have a man deep in the wire. Grab a buggy and help him out. Kid's name is Dalton, and he's pretty spooked. What spooked him? Guess you're gonna find out. <laughs> How about no? Yeah. <laughs> he's there! Oh my god. Alright guys, so we're gonna end this episode here, not to make it too long, so I guess I'll see you in the next part of James Cameron's Avatar, alright? Bye bye.